Salawam, first and foremost, I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh. Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Harakakwadash. Yahweh is the true name of the Heavenly Father, who the world ignorantly calls God in the name of his son, Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, and now in the name of the Holy Spirit, like you. And I want to give a double honors unto my apostles and elders of Great Millstone that do rule well, that have taught me this truth. And I would like to also say a sincere shalom unto the hopeful elect, unto, true, unto the true and sincere brothers that are prophesying and laboring in this doctrine, that are diligent, that are continuing to endure. Unto you, I say shalom. They continue to make mockery of this of the truth. All right, and this is in this video specifically. I guess uh, IUIC uh, the bishop or the general Nathaniel's responding to Alazar of. Um, Sakari with his, um, you know, he, I guess he wants to debate them or has a thousand dollars to debate the new covenant and they're making mockery of it. All right. It's almost like when Yahweh Shai overthrew the, 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 the tables in the temple because they were making the, um, the Lord's house, a, uh, um, a, 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 a place of, um, merchandise or they're doing the same thing, both sides. Okay. The, the, the truth ain't up for debate. All right. And they're really making a mockery about this truth. Like you can, you like, you know, it ain't about all that. All right. It's about waking up the elect. Okay. Edifying the elect. All right. The, not the whole nation, the elect. All right. And these guys, you know, these guys are, you know, the most highs at the same time, he's revealing Esau, he's revealing Israel. He revealing these Jakes. All right. He took the name from them. All right. They want to debate something, debate the name. All right. That, that's one, that's, probably the most important thing of beginning to understand this truth, the beginning to have the Lord sup with you and, and open your eyes. All right. These guys, and they know some things, but they don't got the whole thing. All right. They, they don't got a hundred percent. They may have 99, they have 98, they may have 99.9. .9. All right. But they don't have a hundred percent truth because they're off on their doctrine and it's shown. Okay. The Lord is really not dealing with them. All right. Um, let me grab, let me start with this, uh, by the truth. Um, buy the truth and sell it not. Uh, this is Proverbs uh, 23 and verse 23. It reads, buy the truth and sell it not. Also wisdom and instruction and understanding. Let me get this in another uh, translation and see what it says. It says, uh, let me see, NIV, buy the truth and do not sell it. Wisdom, instruction, and insight as well. All right, we're not supposed to be selling the truth. The truth is not... It, it, it's the truth is the truth, okay? But why would you want to uh, 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 make merchandise of the Most High Truth? It even it's not even our truth. All right, the Lord has, um, you know, those who He's have has called. He's opened their eyes to understand this truth, not for their own purpose, not to, um, uh, uh, um, you know, uh, uh, boast in knowledge or not to uh, um, build them up like they're somebody. All right, but to edify the elect, all right, the the uh, uh, to wake up, okay, the the elect that's going to hear this truth, that's going to be quickened with the spirit of Yahweh Shimon Shai, and 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 come into this truth, and those men to be teachers, all right, and those um you know the the, the women to repent, all right, and, and and teach the other women, and you know teach the and teach their children, all right, so the elect can be sealed. That's what it's about. This is about building up the elect, not the whole nation. And when these Jakes, man, IUIC, you got to call them out. All right. They're, they're, they're making a mockery of this truth. Like they're, they're, they're like, you know, presenting this truth to the world or you're, to, as, as something that can, that can be bought. All right. That's something that is, uh, is like, you could put a price tag on the truth. They want to debate the new covenant, you know? Yeah. Hey, they were not in the new covenant, but according to these people, all right, IUIC, they say we are, and I've done lessons, brothers done many lessons on uh, um, showing you that we're clearly not in the new covenant, but that's besides the point, all right, it, it, these Jakes continue to, um, like I said, make a mockery, make a make merchandise of this truth, and the Lord is going to begin to send out these judgments, okay, because it, it, it you can't change the truth, all right, um, and, that, and that's what they're trying to do. They're coming with their own interpretation. Like the scripture says, there's no private interpretation uh, uh, of the scriptures. All right, let me... Um, let 
Let me give you this. Let me get this. Uh, it's a few scriptures in 2 Corinthians uh, chapter 6. And i um, start at verse 14. Verse 14 is a point. Be not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. For what fellowship hath righteousness with unrighteousness? And what communion hath light with darkness? All right? Well, you, if, if you don't, if we don't agree with these guys, as, as, as far as doctrine is concerned, we don't got no dealings with them. All right? If they don't, if we're out there teaching and someone can't get it, and we break it down so many different ways, and we're not going to debate, you know, we're not going to debate. Oh well, the Gentiles can be saved, or, or or the heathens can be saved. We're not going to debate that. All right, we're going to read what the scripture says. We're going to break it down. We're going to get all the meat off the bone. All right, and and, and that's it. All right, like when Yahweh Shai spoke, Yahweh Shai spoke with authority. All right, when Yahweh Shai spoke, that was it. It wasn't no rebuttal. It, you know, Yahweh Shai. Left them like left a lot of those false uh, uh, teachers and uh, the Sadducees and uh, uh, Pharisees. He left them like they, he left their mind jacked up. All right. One, one scripture says when Yahweh Shai answered them, I like the one where he says this scripture uh, this has been fulfilled this day. Let me grab that real quick because a a after uh, it's another scripture that says they never asked him another question after that. All right, and we're representations of Yahweh Shai. Okay, you know, uh, um, at, you know, a, a, as the prophets, all right, as being the um, the hopeful elect, all right, and, and when the, you know, like I said, when we speak this truth, we're coming uh, um, from a, uh, um, we're, we're 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 speaking, you know, Yahweh Shai, Yah, the spirit of Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai is speaking through us, so it ain't, you know, it ain't no error, okay, you know, brothers have, the apostles have studied tedious and, and and have taught the elders the elders have passed it down and this passed down to the brothers that you see teaching uh, uh now all right first starting with the name all right and then going on to the major prophecies all right um damn let me see what i want to get um let me jump back a couple of chapters to the fourth um to the fourth chapter uh second uh, second corinthians four and i'm going to say at verse six for the Most High, who commanded the light to shine out of darkness, have shined in our hearts and give the light of the knowledge of the glory of the Most High in the in the face of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. All right, and that light is this truth. All right, these guys they don't got the they don't they don't they don't got the light. They don't got the hundred percent light. Okay, they they know some things. I I you know I give it to you know a bunch of these camps. They they push Israel. All right, but the Lord is not looking for half-ass Israelites. The Lord's not looking like for part-time Israelites that know some things, but they don't know the name. Okay, because that prophet or that you could call them false prophet, they're not going to give it to you straight because a lot of these Israelites are compromised. All right, they you see that they're doing things for filthy lucre. All right, they 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 have ulterior motives. All right, and you know. The, the 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 hopeful elect, the, the true servants of the, the true the true servants of the Lord, the real prophets can see right through the bullshit. All right, and the apostles have you know the apostles have seen damn near everything in this truth. All right, far as you know, false prophets, people coming up, uh, uh, um, you know, making um, merchandise of the truth and you know changing the doctrine and coming against them with different doctrines and trying to debate them. We ain't the truth ain't up for debate. All right, back to the verse I want to read. Uh, the point is seven. But we have this treasure in earthen vessels that the excellency of the power may be of the most high and not of us. Like I said, this is not our truth. Okay? And, and, and they're really giving this truth, I hate to say, like a, 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 a black eye where, you know, the, the world look, the world should be looking at us as, you know, um, what it says in Deuteronomy, the fourth chapter, uh, is examples. All right? Not, not, you know the the they they they, they you know the, the outside world you know Jake's looking at this all right it's just gonna think like all oh, these niggas ain't nothing but another uh, uh 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 you know another movement or 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 you know just like the church they just know the scriptures and they just you know dress in fringes and t-shirts and hats and they got to you know the, the world look at you know IUIC not IUIC but they'll look at them too um they'll look at them as some type of black power movement and they'll look at these niggas as just some niggas with uh uh, uh with, with with hats and um so basically some niggas that know they Israelites. All right, 
Um, let me see. Um, and the Lord is, the Lord is really exposing, all right, the, these groups because and, and, and taking the truth that they once had away from them. All right, that oil. All right, uh, uh, of the ten vir the ten virgins. All right, that that, that oil, all right, which is synonymous with um, with, with with wisdom. The Lord has taken it from them. All right, and they didn't. They, the the bishop or cardinal or whatever he calls himself, he's teaching all kind of bugged out ass shit. All right, about the Sabbath, from everything from the Sabbath to the MOTB, to uh, you know, was once was teaching that the MOTB was an embargo. You know, uh, um, they teach uh, uh that. If after a thousand years Esau is going to mount up in the kingdom and and um you know uh, come against us, all right? They teach all this shit because the Lord is really not dealing with him. The Lord is has taken his name from him, okay? And and he's taken any other knowledge, any other pure knowledge that he, they once had away from these guys. And just same thing with um this uh, what is this a uh, Sakari, all right? They they teach the name. But a lot of this shit that they do, other things they teach are off, like having sex on the Sabbath day, all right? And the whole the, 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 the whole image that they give of the truth, all right? Like I said, we represent Yahweh Shah. We're supposed to come in a humble, meek spirit, all right? Not in the spirit of uh, of pride and, and uh, being boastful, all right? Yeah, we pride ourselves in this truth, in the doctrine, okay? But we, hey, we're nothing. Like the scripture I just read, this is not of us, all right? I want to get uh, Amos 3 and 7. Um, Surely the Lord power will do nothing, but he revealeth his secrets unto the, his servants, the prophets. And the true secrets are revealed unto the true and sincere brothers out there. All right. It's not it's not revealed to them. Even if even if it is revealed to them, the Lord it, it has taken certain things from them. has taken the most important thing of this truth, the name. All right. Has taken the prophecy or excuse me, the breakdown of the MOTB. All right, that, that's a major prophecy. All right, if you're not teaching the MOTB it is the micro C hip, you, then you're not a true prophet. All right, the Lord is ultimately not dealing with you. You can, you know, have these great garments and have, you know, be a great orator, a great speaker. All right, you use these big words and you're able to break down certain scriptures with elegance and, you know, and, 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 and you know, um, your, your, uh, your uh, congregation can understand and you know, you, you feel that you're building up, but if you can't tell them what the MOTB is, then you ain't you ain't got the truth. All right, at the end of the day. All right, um let me see. Uh like I said, the Lord is only dealing with his elect, man. The Lord is um and, and that and that's who and that's who we're prophesying to. That's who our lessons go out to the elect. All right. We ain't out up here. You know, uh, uh, trying to you know persuade nobody because if you hear the word, you hear the word. All right, if if if, if the word, um, um, you know, when you hear the word, if you're quickened with the spirit, all right, the the the, the Lord will sup with you. The Lord will open your eyes. All right, but if it ain't for you, it ain't for you. Okay, it, it, like it, we ain't, I ain't about to sit up here and you know debate. Apostles not about to debate and then hope we get some followers or hope if we win this debate, you know, uh, this will build us up. And, and we could sell, sell some merchandise and we build this, we win this debate, we may get more followers. Hey, that, that, Yahweh, like I said, Yahweh Shai wasn't up there debating. He was, he was, you know, cutting these guys with the scriptures. All right. He wasn't up there debating or let's go back and forth and, you know, we'll come back tomorrow and talk about it. When Yahweh Shai spoke, that was it. All right. It, it was, it wasn't, it wasn't nothing said after that. They didn't have no more questions. After Yahweh Shai cut him with the scriptures. All right. Um, let me see. Speaking of the elect, let me grab this. Um, Isaiah 1 and um, 9. Except the Lord of hosts have left unto us a very small rim, and we should have been at Sodom, and we should have been like unto Gomorrah. Speaking of the elect again. All right. They, when, they, they, when the elect hears his truth, all right, they're, they're going to, you know, they're going to, when the elect hears the truth, they're going to be, they're going to be changed, okay? They're, they're going to, uh, um, you know, the, the spirit of the Lord is going to be on them, and they're going to, you know, they're going to, um, how does it say John 10? They're, they're uh, I'm going to get it. Um, John 10, uh, they won't hear the uh, voice of another, I believe it says similar to that. 
Um, John 10 and 1, Verily, verily, I say unto you, he that entereth not by the door into the sheepfold, but climbeth up some other way, the same is a thief and a robber. And these guys are trying to climb up another way through debate, through, um, you know, trying to persuade Jake through uh, um, different gimmicks and shit. All right. Uh, uh, high holy days. And they, hey, they're, they're that thief and that robber trying to come up another way. But he that entereth in the door is a shepherd of the sheep. To him the porter openeth, and the sheep hear they're the sheep hear his voice, and he calleth his own sheep by name and leadeth them out. All right? And he putteth forth his own sheep, and he goeth before them, and the sheep follow him, for they know his voice. And that the the uh the shepherd is Yahweh Shai. All right, and the elect represent the sheep that won't, you know, uh won't follow us. Well, it's gonna say it, verse five. And a stranger will they not follow, but will flee from him, for they know not the voice of strangers. All right, and these other prophets, these false prophets, are, are that's the voice of strangers. All right, so a member of the elect see the a member of the elect is going to see through the bullshit. All right, I'm gonna play this real quickly because these guys is they they really full of themselves. All right, Al Alizar's put up a thousand dollars, you know, and and. And, and, and these niggas is the, and IUIC is just you know they acting like a thousand dollars ain't shit, but at the same time they off, all right. And, and they and and at the end they's gonna say, oh we're not about the money. If we were covered, just we're about the money. But they got a thing donate to the booster club, a uh, uh, text to donate. You, you so you see what they're about, all right. I'll play this a little bit. Whatever IUIC said, the scriptures said, that's what he said. We're not going to debate you. We say we are in the new, the new company, we are in the new company. Take a pen and paper, take no, shut the hell up. <laughs> I'm telling you, we're not going to debate none of you. We got the authority over this Bible. And, and we got we sit to prove it. All right, whatever we say, it said, that's what he said. He said that God says that a man... A man don't supposed to, a man don't supposed to cover his head when he pray. That's what the, yo, that's it. We ain't got, we ain't arguing with you and debating you about that. We say women put on skirts, stop wearing pants. We're not arguing with nobody about that. Tell you brothers today in our captivity, every man is to have one wife because that's what the scripture teaches. We're not arguing with you all about that. And yeah, these guys is off and off and off. You could, you could, you know, it's so much, they're waxing worse and worse as the scripture says. All right, worse and worse. All right, every every week, every two weeks is something new. All right, and, and you know, it, and his brothers, that's you know, that that's it's a spirit that's really scoping these guys out. All right, that where where they where where you know we're correcting them. We make these rebuttal videos, and you know, it, it's nothing personal. It's just you know, hey, members of the elect out there may see, you know, these videos, and they want they want the truth. Okay, and. You know, I, I, I hate that, you know, but, you know, we got to keep getting on these guys. But it is, that's just the spirit, all right? It's going to be a lot of, um, uh, uh, in these last days, it's going to be a lot of videos where there is um, rebuke, all right, correction, all right? Because we're hunting, we're, we're fishing for the elect, all right? And elect is amongst some of these groups. And, you know, and the Lord is going to, you know, eventually, you know, uh, pull them up out of these groups and bring them to the 100% doctrine, all right? So, yeah, that's all I really had. I just not want to go too long on this, but these guys continue to make a mockery of the truth, and the Lord is going to begin to make examples of a lot of these jakes, man, all right? They, they, they're proud. They're boastful, all right? Hey, the truth ain't up for debate, and, and you know, you know, that's all, you know, that's all I want to get in, you know, go into on this, you know, this topic. So, Lord willing, this lesson was uh, edifying unto the elect, and I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Harakakudash, Shalom.